Matthew Stuckey here from Verity Baptist Church, Philippines, just giving you a quick missionary update. This past week we had a total of 144 salvations, and so we had a soul winning marathon this past Saturday um, in uh, Metro Manila, and uh, there's a holiday. We always have soul winning on Saturdays anyway, but this was kind of an extra push, so we had good results for that. Uh, we've had a couple down weeks recently. Um, it's been kind of crazy here, and the restrictions have been tough, but they did switch from ECQ back to MECQ. And so it's definitely opened things up, and so we were able to have better soul winning results. Um, in terms of sermons preached, I preached a two-part series on street preaching that you can uh, check out. It's on our um, YouTube channel if you want to check that out. And also I preached through uh, Genesis 1. I finished that chapter as we're doing that on our midweek service in Pampanga. And so uh, we're going through the book of Genesis. So those are the sermons preached. Things are going well overall. Um, you know, we did recently start a new ministry in uh, Beacle. So if you are in the Beacle area, uh, we'd love to have you participate in that. Um, and so just get in touch with me if you have any questions. Uh, they're doing a great job down there. They're getting a lot of people saved. So that's definitely helping our overall results. And so it's kind of a new ministry, but uh, people have already, some people have already heard about it and are joining it. And so uh, get in touch with me if you'd like to be a part of that. And I do want to mention, I try to mention this just every once in a while, because there are like-minded brethren in some other countries that maybe you tune into our ministry but you're not aware of. And uh, there are like-minded um, brothers and sisters in Christ meeting in Singapore, in Hong Kong, and in the UAE. So if you have any questions about those groups or uh, those areas, if, if you're like-minded, you know, let me know. I'd love to help get you in touch with the soul winners there. And, um, but overall, things are going great for us right now. Um, things have opened up recently, which is great. And so one new thing that I started doing, um, if you tune into our Facebook, uh, you might have seen it. One of my, my favorite hobbies is to actually write poems. And um, I first wrote a poem when I was in my mid-twenties um, for a friend of mine that was a, a soul winning friend that had passed away. And before that I didn't realize I had any ability to write poems whatsoever. But it's kind of a hobby of mine, but obviously life gets very busy so it's hard to keep up with um, you know, the hobbies that you have. But I started a new YouTube channel which I'm going to link in the description below, uh, Conservative Christian Poetry. And kind of the purpose of the channel is to give uh, Bible poetry, go through various characters, uh, various stories, but also go through doctrines that we believe as uh, conservative, fundamental, Bible-believing Christians. And it's a hobby I enjoy, and if you're into poetry, maybe you'll like the channel, uh, maybe you won't. Um, I'm not so great at uh, doing videos. Um, I'm kind of a bit of a rookie at that, so I'm trying to learn how to make it more entertaining than me just reading a poem. But um, if you would be interested in um, you know, poetry, you might want to subscribe to that channel. I will have the link uh, below. But uh, overall, things are going pretty well here. It's, it's still moderately uh, strict here. It's still under MECQ, so it still does restrict some people from coming. But it's definitely better than when it was on ECQ. And so overall, though, things are going well. Just continue to be in uh, prayer for our ministry. And thank you, and God bless.